Hey guys, Liam here from Hunks Plastic, and today we're going to be looking at this awesome Star Wars The Black Series Galaxy's Edge 3-pack. This is the first order 3-pack. Three, three um, there are uh, three 3-packs three in total at our, our exclusive to Galaxy's Edge. We have a Droids one, the Resistance one, and then the first order one. So now, these are a little pricey, uh, so I just got one. But this one I thought was the coolest, so this is the one I got. And today, we're going to be doing in, we're gonna be doing an unboxing video. Um... So yeah, as you can see in the front, uh, you got Cap uh, Commander Pride, um, Kylo Ren, obviously, and then the Mountain Trooper, who I'll be explaining in a little bit. Uh, flip it around, you get a little description of each of these characters. So Commander Pride, it says Commander Pride, a uh, fearsome First Order Stormtrooper officer, Commander Pride, stands out from the Legion of identically equipped soldiers with his black and gold armor. You'll see him in a little bit. Everything's black and white on here. But you'll see his gold armor, it's so cool, guys. Um, and we have the mouse droid. All of you, I'm pretty sure, are familiar with mouse droid. Uh, now, mouse, um, M-I-E-M-S-E, -E, or mouse droids, perform simple tasks aboard starships and in military and corporate facilities. They beep to themselves as they perform small, uh, small repairs, deliver messages, and uh, guide visitors occasionally exploding into panicked squeals when confused or frightened. Uh, so we see these in the New Hope, along another uh, other you know we see them in uh, Star Wars Rebels and maybe I'd, I haven't seen Star Wars Resistance yet. Um, if you guys have seen Star Wars Resistance, definitely like comment down below because I haven't seen that yet and I'm not sure if it's a good show or not. So comment down below. I don't know. Uh, Kylo Ren. I don't really think we need the description of Kylo Ren, but uh, just in case. Uh, Kylo Ren, the son of Han Solo and Leia Organa, Ben Solo was seduced by the dark side of the Force and renamed himself Kylo Ren, becoming the First Order's champion and supreme leader Snoke's student. And finally, we have the Mountain Trooper. I think the Mountain Trooper is, like, by far my favorite guy. Um, because his character was made solely for Galaxy's Edge. So Galaxy's Edge is set in the Star Wars land of Batuu, or Batuu, uh, not really sure how to say that. Uh, so as you can see, Mountain Troopers... Uh, the Mountain Troopers, like all Force Order Stormtroopers, specialized units of Batu Mountain Troopers are trained from birth, growing up with uh, unit designations instead of names, and fed a steady diet of First Order propaganda to ensure absolute loyalty. So this guy, these guys are like, you know, they're pretty tough. They're kind of scary. Uh, now, I'm going to open up uh, the Velcro on the inside, which looks super cool. And what? How cool is that, guys? So, um, before we get to the actual figures, here's just, like, a little description, um, of the First Order, basically. So, it's the Star Wars, the Black Series, after the fall of the Galactic Empire, former Imperial officers, nobles, and tech technologists plotted a return to power. Um, as you can see, we have Little, little Visitor. He does come by a few episodes. Uh, this is, of course, my cute, amazing cat, Christmas. Christmas, you want to say hi to the people? He does not want to say hi to the people. He just left. That's so unfortunate. Uh, that was totally planned, obviously. You know, totally planned. Uh, let's get back to our first order. Um, so it says, led by Supreme Leader Snoke and commanded by Kylo Ren. That's the first order. These guys look amazing. As you can see, Commander Pride in his gold armor. Kylo Ren in his black armor, obviously. This is Kylo, kind of Kylo Ren. Uh, and then we have the Mountain Troop. Uh, so Mountain Troop comes with, like, this long rifle. Uh, has some weathering on it. Kylo Ren comes with this lightsaber, opened and up, uh, on and not on. And then Commander Pride comes with a pistol, which I believe fits in the holster. I guess we'll find out. Oh, look, he's back. Again, guys, of course, obviously, this is planned. My cat coming into the uh, the show, he's, you know, he's a professional. Don't worry, guys. Um, Yeah, and then we have the mouse droid, obviously. I'm excited. Are you guys excited? Because I'm excited. I'm not sure about you guys. I'm excited. Uh, Yeah, let's open this thing up. Christmas, you want to help open this thing up? Just be careful. Careful, there's a knife Christmas. Yeah, I, don't, I don't want you getting hurt. I don't want you getting hurt on us, all right? All right, Christmas. You want to hop down there? All righty. Coolio. Uh, believe it or not, this is actually the first time I've ever opened a Black Series. Uh, I have a good amount of Black Series figures. Good amount as in, you know, maybe an unhealthy obsession. Uh, but yeah, I do have a, a lot of Black Series figures. And this is the only one I'm opening up. Uh, the reason for this is that I thought these figures were so cool, and I wanted to take them out of the box. I wanted to, you know, look at them. I wanted to, you know, pose them. Uh, maybe take some, like, I don't know. Maybe take some, like, uh, photography. I know a lot of people do that on Instagram. Um, I do have an Instagram account. If you guys want to check that out, that would be pretty cool. 
pretty cool view. It's called, uh, same name, same name of the YouTube channel, Hunks of Plastic. So if you guys want to check that out, definitely check that out, because, uh, you know, it's a pretty cool channel. I mean, I think it is my channel. I'm, uh, my page, if I guess. Oh, God, this is sick. Oh, my God. Guys, this is sick. All right, I'm going to put this box down. Obviously, I'm going to keep the box, because it's a cool box. Really, really cool box. And it's close to Galaxy's Edge. These are sick. I might have to take the rest of my Galaxy, my, the rest of my um, Black Series figures out. I don't know. Put that red cardboard film kind of out. And we got the figures. Guys, these are sick. So this guy kind of looks like, now that I'm looking at it, kind of looks like the Shore Trooper, only, you know, in like the Mountain Gear. Uh, Kylo Ren and then Commander Pride. So let's pop these guys out. Uh, first, I'm going to get the weapons out. Pop the little weapons out. First, we've got Kylo Ren's lightsaber. Uh, that's the lightsaber on. I'm not sure if you have, yeah, you can pop that off. And then we got Kylo Ren's lightsaber not on. Uh, I'm actually gonna, yeah, I'm gonna take the Mountain Trooper out first. You guys don't mind? Coolio? I hope that's Coolio. Because, uh, I think this guy might be my favorite. Or should I save him for less? Too late, come out. Let's see if I can get him out. That would be pretty unfortunate if I just can't get him out. He might be stuck in there forever. Let's see if I can get these out. Might have to edit this. Just cut to him all the figures out. Might take a while. Alright guys, now that we finally have them uh, unboxed, did take a little bit, but uh, you know, we have them all unboxed now. Uh, so let's go from left to right. First we have the, uh, the Mountain Trooper. This guy is sick. The paint job on this guy is absolutely amazing. If the camera can focus. Uh, so why don't we go for the weapon? We'll uh, you know, look at the weapon first. Might be easier. Pop off this. It doesn't exactly say the weapon, but it does look like an E11, only with an extended barrel. And then you got the stock on the back. With like this uh so yeah really cool so if you can like kind of cut cut it off like right here and then right here the base is like an e11 which is the you know basic storm trooper uh storm trooper blaster it's just like a heavy e11 i guess uh so you got this like stock coming out right here really cool weathering uh you know it's kind of like a metallic paint and then on some parts like right here not sure if the light can catch it uh and like on the handle over here the carrying handle um you know really nice weathering uh, kind of looks like it's scratched up. Really cool. Uh, here's the ammo. Uh, I'm not really sure if it would be called a magazine in the Star Wars universe, but, uh, you know, that is, uh, the ammo. Um, over here, is that a flashlight or is that a, I think it's the carrying handle, but it might be a flashlight. Not really sure. Um, uh, yeah, we got this. Uh, that's the, uh, the cooling system and the gun. Um, magazine, and then, uh, handle, obviously. And then, finally, the scope, right here. Got the scope. Yeah, really cool gun. Like it. Now, the figure. Alright, we're going to the figure. Uh, let's just go to the top, from the top up. So, we got, uh, these really nice boots with, like, these straps. All these straps running back. Uh, we have, like, this dirt, uh, this dirt, um, like, weathering all around, which is really cool. Let's see if I can pop this off. I can get the helmet. Might be easier to just review the helmet. No, oh, can't pop it off. I'm sure I can eventually, but uh, yeah, no, I don't want to risk breaking it. So he does have this uh, this red cauldron on his uh, left shoulder, and then uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it. Uh, white, black, and then you know that red, and then some dirt markings all the way around. So like normal normal stormtrooper um, utility blow belt have the thermal detonator in the back. Uh, the back of this is a little bit different than the normal stormtrooper, and then these uh these like hip things coming out that's obviously different uh so the only thing really is the same as the stone trooper is like this right here and then the uh the arm uh, obviously the helmet and then the legs are different uh yeah otherwise really cool figure uh next i just actually want to move on to the nail droid that might be just easier it's all black printing a little bit scratched up a little bit uh kind of dirt on it i guess if you guys are stationed in um the two they're gonna get some dirt on them uh, really cool. It's actually, it can roll. Uh, like, the wheels are, are spin, are spinny. They're not just, you know, fixed on there. Really cool. Has this, uh, all these buttons, and then, you know, just a normal mouse droid, which is really cool. I like that. I like that you can, you know, roll it like that. I think it's cool. Uh, Commander Pride. I know we said we can, I, I'll move left to right, but I kind of just, no. Uh, so, Black Cauldron, uh, which I think can be removed. I'm, I'm not going to remove it right now. Uh, he comes with, uh, two, two weapons. You got this one blaster pistol that can be put right here. Normal. That's a normal first order blaster pistol. Only it's only in black. Usually they're white and and um white and black. 
Uh, so yeah, normal blaster pistol. Got a little scope on top, and that goes right um, on the side in that little holster. Uh, this is this is really cool. This uh, this weapon right here. Um, this is the normal uh, first order uh, blaster rifle, only in gold and black instead of white and black. Uh, magazine scope, uh, handle up here, uh, pistol grip, and then you know the stock. It's not really a stock, but you know. And then you got the cooling system in the front. If you guys are wondering what like these holes are, that's the cooling system. Uh, so yeah, let's move on to the figure. You can see I got him in in the position that he's holding his weapon. Uh, so yeah, really, really cool metallic printing all the way around, all the way around him, which I really like. Um, yeah, normal first order, um, normal first order, you know, Snowtrooper outfits only in, uh, in gold. And then he also has that, that black cauldron. Um, yeah, that's really it. So, um, yeah, that's really it. You know, black utility belt. Um, yeah, so like in the Stormtroopers, if this was a Stormtrooper, uh, this right here would be white. Uh, this would still be black this black right here, and then obviously the gold will be also be white. Um, this, this right here would be, uh, so there's three colors in this. There's like this light gray right here. I'm not really sure if the camera can catch it. There's light gray, like plastic, right, right here. Obviously the gold, and then the black. Uh, yeah, that's really it for this figure. Now uh, let's move on to Kylo Ren. So he comes with two accessories. He comes with his, uh, his lightsaber. Uh, and then also comes with uh, his lightsaber that's not on, but uh, I like this better, so I positioned him with this, uh, with his crossbar. And then you got that, like, the wire, the red wire, running up and down. Uh, moving on to the actual figure, the cool part. He has this removable cloak. I'm going to remove it to make it easier. Uh, really bendable. Uh, it's not cloth, but it's it's bendable. And then, yeah, normal Kylo Ren. Oh, okay, ben. He has his little belt, uh, his robe right here, and then his belt, and then obviously his helmet. Got his helmet. And uh, his boots, some cloth printing, uh, cloth design right there. And uh, yeah, that's really it. Hope you guys like. Oh, hope you guys like that video. Uh, as always, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and as always, stay cool.